Do you or anyone at home need to send money to someone in the country but can't go out or don't want to wait in line? Don't worry because now you can actually send money directly from your phone to Palawan Express branches nationwide via the new Palawan Express online padala service in their website. Here's how, including some important things to remember. You will need BDO or BPI mobile banking, coins.ph, or any mobile banking app supporting Instapay to use this service. Simply log on to www.palawanpawnshop.com, then tap on Online Padala. This will take you to the service. Tap on Proceed to Padala, note the transaction limits, and tap on Continue. Then in the form that appears, key in the sender's details, tap on Next, and the receiver's details, including his or her full name and mobile number. The receiver's name should match his or her ID exactly upon pickup, or the cash will not be released. So be very sure that you enter these details correctly. Under Payment Details, you can choose between four payment methods, BDO, BPI, Coins.ph, or any mobile banking app supporting Instapay. First, if you want to pay via BDO, mobile, or online banking, select it and enter the amount you want to send. Note that Palawan Express service fees of about 3% will apply, just like sending money from a branch. So it is generally cheaper, especially for lower amounts, than sending from other platforms. Tap on Continue and a summary will appear for you to check if all the details are correct. If you are satisfied, tap on Confirm. You will be asked to log in to BDO Mobile or Online Banking while taking note of the following details. Once logged in, tap on Send Money, then select To Any BDO Account. Enter the total amount, which includes the principal plus the service fee, the destination account, and the tracking number given in your Palawan Express transfer, and tap on Continue. Once paid, take note of the last 8 digits of your reference number and enter it in your Palawan Express transfer. Tap on Mark as Paid and enter the OTP or one-time password that will be sent to you via text message. Submit and your transfer is complete. There are some important things to remember but first, in case you want to pay via BPI, select it and enter the amount. Note the same Palawan Express service fees will apply. Tap on Continue, then review if all the details of your transaction are correct and continue. You will be asked to launch your BPI mobile banking app and a QR code of Palawan Express's BPI account will be provided for your convenience. You can scan it later or save it into your phone. Launch your BPI mobile banking app and before logging in, tap on Transfer via QR. Then scan the QR code earlier if from another device or import it from your phone. Log in and you will be taken directly to the transfer money form with a destination account already filled out. So just select the account you want to transfer the money from and enter the amount. Remember to include the Palawan Express service fee. Then refer back to your Palawan Express transfer for the tracking number and enter it under Notes. Tap on Next, then check if all the details are correct. Then tap on Confirm. A one-time PIN will be sent to your registered mobile number. Enter and tap on Submit. Once the money has been transferred, look for the confirmation number at the bottom of the screen. Copy and enter it in your Palawan Express transfer. Mark as paid, then enter the verification OTP sent to the sender's given mobile number and tap on Submit. Your transfer is complete. Now if you want to pay via coins.ph, under Payment Details, select it and enter the amount. The same Palawan Express service fees will apply. Continue and check if all the details in the summary is correct. Continue, then take note of Palawan Express's coins.ph mobile number and your tracking number for this transfer. Log in to your coins.ph account 
tap on send, and select send via email, SMS, or Facebook. And in the form that appears, enter Palawan Express's coins.ph mobile number, the total amount including the service fee, and the tracking number for your transfer, given in your Palawan Express transfer. Then slide to send. Once successful, you need to find your reference number. So go to History, take note of the first 9 digits of your transaction, and enter it in your Palawan Express transfer. Mark as paid, and enter the OTP that you will receive via text message. Submit, and your transfer is complete. Now if you want to pay from other banking apps supporting Instapay, select Instapay, and enter the amount. Note that the same Palawan Express service fees will apply and tap on Continue. Review if all the transaction details are correct and again tap on Continue. Here, you will be asked to launch your mobile banking app supporting Instapay. Go to Send or Transfer via Instapay and enter Palawan Express's Destination Bank BDO and account number. Also remember to include the Palawan Express service fee and tracking number. After completing your payment, return here and enter the last 5 digits of your account number as your payment reference number and mark as paid. Then enter the verification OTP sent to the sender's given mobile number and tap on Submit. Your transfer is complete. After payment, take note of the tracking number for future reference. You and the receiver will also receive SMS notifications immediately that your money can already be claimed at Palawan Express branches. So the receiver can already proceed to the branch and claim the cash. Now here are some important things that you and the receiver need to know to ensure a hassle-free transfer. At the branch, the receiver must present both the SMS notification with the transaction code and the valid ID. It is very important that the receiver's details, especially his name, match his or her ID exactly, or the money will not be released. This policy is strictly implemented across all Palawan Express branches. To avoid any potential problems due to misspelled names, the best thing to do is to ask for a photo of the ID and copy the details directly. However, if you do encounter a mistake, you as the sender will need to contact Palawan Express and request for a correction. Go back to Palawan Express Online Padala and tap on the telephone icon on the upper right for their contact information. Be ready with your tracking number and transaction code. Next, when making the payment, remember to transfer the total amount, which includes both the principal amount and the service fee. Also take extra care to copy the tracking number exactly to your chosen payment platform and the correct reference numbers from your chosen platform to Palawan Express. Sending money from Palawan Express's online padala is fast, as if you sent it from a branch. There's no waiting time unlike sending from another platform. Just take note of its operating hours which start at 8 a.m. and closes at 4 p.m. Note these important reminders and you and the receiver can enjoy a hassle-free transfer. So that's how you can send money directly from your phone to Palawan Express branches nationwide using the Palawan Express online Padala service in their website. If you found this video useful, please hit the thumbs up icon and remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching!